Lecter from Cape Fear Wine and Beer. Thanks for taking time to try to answer my questions about the Randall. Um, what I've done differently is I've replaced uh, the float vent valve with a manual vent valve. I've never really got it to work right. Tried a bunch of different things. So uh, on the manual one, you can see I got a big on and off valve, but also on the side I got a real small valve that I can do a pressure release on. And I'm going to show you how it looks when I uh, pour a pint and how it looks in the set the chamber. I start out here. I've slightly opened the valve as it's pouring down. As you can see, it looks pretty normal at this point. Stop. Now it's slowly creeping up. But with the uh, float vent valve assembly that came with it, it would use a stop right about here. And then I would have to jam a paper clip in it to keep it going. Um, but with this, you know, I can actually, you know, turn it up a little higher. And, uh, you know, just get it going right back to the top. A lot of times people want three or four of these in a row. and. I understand it takes a little while, but uh, at least this way I can make it go up to the top pretty good. I picked up this part from a local su plumbing supply, and uh, that's about the fastest I've gotten this thing to refill. Uh, thank you very much for hooking me up with Randall. I loved it. Everybody else liked it too. So. Cheers.